Welcome back. This is Clay Jitsu. Uh, we are going to continue our series of the Fanatical Nemesis 6 bundle. And uh, I think this is going to be the last day, day three of three, hopefully. All right, so we are continuing with the game Dungeon Rushers. I don't even think I've heard of this game before. So this will definitely be kind of a blind playthrough. Alright, there's campaign, shop. How do I get rid of this page? Is this permanently on here? Okay. Workshop, worksite, arena, tavern. Let's just see what the tavern is. Looks like online matches, perhaps. Maybe similar to Anti Hero, which we were playing yesterday. <clears throat> I have new skins. And by new. I mean all of them are new because I just got the game. We have a bard here. Love this pirate. You know he's a pirate because he's got an eye patch. Alrighty. Skins are definitely different than each other. Okie doke. So let's, okay, these buttons don't seem to do anything, so let's back up. Okay, campaign. I was sure that said Eileen. Eileen. Not a big fan of story. I'll like get into a story if the game is good. But if I don't know if the game is going to be good or not, I don't get into the story. Like, there's been too many games where I like spent a half hour watching the story build up in the beginning, and then I got to the game I'm like, wow, this is a terrible game. And I never played it again. So. If it turns out to be a good game, I will go back and pay more attention to the story. Are human in our dusty galleries? Skeletons have galleries now, apparently. They're artsy skeletons. Artsy skeleton warriors. All right, let's see. If only I could somehow sneak by and avoid a fight. <laughs> Obviously the game doesn't take itself too seriously. Oh my bone. He's immune to bleeding. Reasonable. Right click a fighter to show more details. Health, magic, energy, skills, a basic attack to weaken the enemy. Shoots an arrow at an enemy. Thrust a poison blade between the enemy's ribs. In general, rogues traditionally have not been effective against skeleton warriors. Sharp attack. Sharp rusty blade attack. Also gives you tetanus. Do I drag it? Okay.
Okie doke. I got an iron sword. Click on Eileen's icon, and it's Eileen from now on, I'm sorry, to open the inventory. Sorry, Eileen, or whatever your name is. I have a sword, iron sword, as opposed to the scourer's brush I was using before. Why does it say new? See, this is BS. First of all, I'm definitely not buying a color palette swap for $2. So why does it say new? I already don't like this game. Like, it's like, oh, you have a new skin. And it's like, unlock. And then unlock brings you to the Steam store, really? So this game already has like two strikes against it. So let's give it like one more chance. Yes, your self-deprecating humor will not save you this time, whatever your name is, game. Yay, I got a new sword and did the exact same amount of damage. Alright, I, I think that might be... Unless something amazing happens right now, that might be strike three for this game. I mean, I did equip the sword over my bone duster, right? Yes, I did. Anyway. Yeah, I don't even know if I want to fight this boss. Yeah. Alright, I'm good. I'm good on this game. I'm good on this game. Alright, so we're closing that. We're going to uninstall that. Kind of a shame because this has been... Uh, we have not uninstalled that much uh, this bundle dungeon rushers uninstall <clears throat> okay next uh, let's see Juanito arcade mayhem is the next game one moment while it loads up Super Wieners Turn Blonde. Okay. Game ever. Alrighty. Options. I think we're okay now. Wow, different pajamas. I think that's some cartoon. Christmas. I'll do the standard since I've never played before. Alright, select. Back out. At least it doesn't make me pay for skins as soon as I start the game up. Oh, that's where I just was. Um, is it just keyboard? I guess so. That is a negative in my book. Hey, it's co-op. Same screen co-op, I assume. Go, Juanito, you got this. Balls Gluck. 
that was somewhat entertaining. If your story is a little entertaining, then I'll watch it. Especially if I'm having coffee. If this is same screen co-op, I assume we control each one. There has to be controller. You can't have same screen co-op with mouse and keyboard. Realistically. Okay, well, the controller is working. Okay. Are we just shooting up and that's it? If I were good, I'd be like, juggle it like that. Uh, the game mechanics don't seem that interesting to me. Oh, save my non-existent buddy. Oh yeah. The game is definitely, like, has kind of a polished look to it, but if you're just shooting up the entire time like Space Invaders, obviously it's a Space Invaders tribute. I don't know what we're doing here. Okay. You're gonna make me do the same level again? Again, we're on like two strikes for this game. If there's nothing... What are you doing? If there's nothing interesting about this level, it's gonna get uninstalled as well. Like, and like the... Alright, well, this may be interesting. No, not really, because you're still just shooting up. Yeah. Nope. See, I don't care if you're a little indie company. I don't care. I don't care if you're a little indie company, or EA, or Blizzard, or whatever. I don't care. If I don't enjoy the game, it gets uninstalled. That's all there is to it. Sorry. Okay, where is that final game? Ah, here we go. The Metronomicon. I have played this game before, and I like it. Now, I haven't played it that much, but I think you're going to enjoy this game. It is a rhythm game, like Rock Band, except you are a... Um, you are a uh, party of adventurers, and you have to defeat monsters to the rhythm. Sure, I'll use a controller. Oh wait, is there a third-party phone again? Just plug it in before launching the game, which I already did. Great. Okay. Use pre-created characters to quickly dive into unlock songs with at will, no leveling up. Okay. Check out options real quick. So yes, yeah, so I've played this before. It's pretty awesome. Do I want to do the sync? Sure. Press the menu, enter key, and sync with the repeating tone until it completes. The menu. Come on, this should be enough for you. Okay, I'm done. Until it completes. I'm, I'm impatient. You gotta get the job done. I gave you like 20 seconds.
No, I'm not doing that. Nope, not doing it. We're just going to X that out and we're going to restart. If you're not in sync with me, then it's your fault. All right, let's check this out. The music is great in this game. It's very catchy. All right, story mode. Hey, there's multiplayer. I guess the same screen multiplayer. Ooh, same screen multiplayer. I have a video game night at my house. This might be a good one for that. Plus RB to modify your team. I don't think that was available before. Oh, okay, so you can change the order that they're standing in. Replace hero. Oh, I see, you can swap them out. Okay, interesting. I do remember having the, um, <laughs> the shield person the farthest away from the enemies. I don't know if it makes a difference or not, but we'll just go ahead and, um, all right, let's just go. Go. Unfortunately, I'm turning my volume down so you, can, you don't have an echo. All right, let's do this. Go. <clears throat> I don't know what to do. Do I use the D-pad? I'm going to try that. Alright, now, okay, I need to use the... Oops. So, like, the, the healer cures. We can do better. And if you get into the red, you do, like, a more powerful version of your ability. And you can level it up so you can go... I think some of them like maybe can't go to red or something like that, and you can make it so they can. Maybe there's colors after red. Love the enemies. The enemies are so awesome. I don't know. I, I don't know. This e Either Antihero or Metronomicon are worth the bundle, getting the entire bundle, e even if it only had one of those. It is absolutely, I mean, you should definitely get at least one copy, um, since there's both of them in there. Like, get, get two. Is he, what is he throwing at us? Is that poop? I hope it's mud. The music's great. The enemies are great. The heroes are pretty cool. The idea is cool. So I'm using the D-pad to hit the points. And I'm using the bumpers to go right, in this case. And the calibration is a little off, but this rhythm is so easy that it doesn't really matter. Whoops. As, I, as I'm in the middle of talking about how easy it is in this one. My only regret with these kind of games is that you can't see what's going on because you're paying attention to the rhythm.
Yeah. I assume I won. I feel like I did well. Alright, our number 6170 on the leaderboard. I knew I would do something with my life. Alright, whatever, press A. There should be a prompt for that. Alright, I don't actually know. Okay, so it says, oh, it's got my save from like a year ago. Okay. Right, that's that one. I'll just redo this one real quick because I haven't done it in a year and you haven't seen it. Unless you've seen it. And then we'll just move on from there. I think I played like the beta or something like that. A lot of these games I play like the beta or alpha. I try to stay on top of new games coming out and old games that are bundled. Yeah, I try to like steal a glance over at um, the monster because they look interesting out of the corner of my eye. But then I like miss something. I don't think I've seen this monster before. So this is multiplayer. I assume, obviously, same screen multiplayer. I would assume. So you notice the healer only has one level. He can't go into the red like this guy. I guess my guys are partially leveled up also. Maybe that's why some of them can go into the red. I assumed it was like due to the update or something like that. But sure, I'll see if I can get my healer up to uh, the next level or whatever. Whoops, messed that up. And I could be doing this more strategically, I'm sure. Like, looking at my team's health and switching to the healer. That sort of thing. Or skipping the healer if we don't need health. But I'm not that advanced on this game. I love how they... Oh, can, do I have to play this guy? Uh, okay, this was unusual. I have not seen this before. So you have to switch to those. Okay, I was just, just doing my own thing. Switch to healer. I don't know what my health is at, but let's go ahead and give everybody a heal. I love how Violet is an explorer. Oh, exploder. Okay, I thought it was an explorer. Okay, she's an exploder. Hey, I'm increasing in the world. I'm at 5,980 on the leaderboard now. Not bad. Okay, so... Can I do anything other than hit A? Yes, I can hit B with the exact same result. Okay, so let's see. RB to modify your team. So... Interesting. She could, like... Can I switch her to water? I can, apparently. Okay. He's got Cure. Is there any way I can level him up? Oh, I've got equipment. Can 
interesting. Sure. All right. So is he is now wearing the shin pads? Yes, he is. All right, let's put something on her. Whoops. Bandage wraps, power drink. Okay. Let's put... Let's give him the power drink or whatever. Oh, he's got other stuff. All cans. Oh, interesting. Okay. So now let's go to her, maybe. And give her the power drink. Okay. Alrighty. That's not what I wanted to do, but I guess that's useful. <sighs> Replace hero means replace hero, like place them again. How did replace come to mean something other than place again? How did that happen? When did replace start meaning take away? When did that happen? Only a linguist will know. All right, what's team attack? Explosive bum rush. Drops out all but the one most complicated track. Each note hit causes an immediate hero attack. Catch enough notes before it ends for one last massively damaging bang. Cancels ongoing boss attacks. Okay, not sure how to do that. Maybe the options will help. I wonder if they level up automatically. Oh, I see. Changing leaderboard mode. Alright. This is the workshop. Your list of achievements can be viewed at the, board, the Bard's info shop. Oh, I remember this. You could buy stuff. Boots and pants. Unce, unce, unce. 800 street creds. Make lazy get stronger. Gizmos and junk. Good gear is hard to come by. Okay. I don't know how much money I have. Oh, I have zero. Okay, well, not here. Adventurer is what I was doing. Okay. Let's try another one. Enemy Rampage Challenge. Side quest reward is the Dazzle Wand. Cures heal for 20% more, but casting recovery is 50% longer. Why would I want that? Like... Okay. See, I don't I don't like things in games that have a plus and a minus. Now I know they can lead to some kind of to some like tactical advantages, but this game doesn't seem very tactical to me. Like so like, oh if I if I ping it, you know, if I increase how much I heal and then this other guy can mul multiply what I heal, then it might be worth it. But just in general, I just want a straight buff. If I'm earning something with a side quest that I don't even have to do, I just want a straight buff. Whoops, I'm effing that up. Let's see what we got here. Still let me into the red, so that's nice. Focus. 
I love how they like almost trip and fall when I miss a when I miss a note. She says, I wonder how to do that. Um, I'm going to press all the buttons and see what they do. Okay, nothing. I, I was trying to figure out how to do, um, like, my group attack or whatever. Success, Dazzle Wand. Alright, definitely a keep. I already knew that about this game. I'll definitely be playing more of this one. Alright, and I believe that's the last game. So, thank you very much for joining me. Um, and I will definitely continue to do these reviews. This has been the... Um, Nemesis 6 bundle at fanatical.com. Um, you know, I buy a lot of their bundles. They're, you know, sometimes they're good, sometimes they're not good. That's why I'm here. And uh, I'll, Humble Bundle also had a fighting bundle that just came out. I should be reviewing that soon. So, anyway, thank you very much for joining me, and I will catch you next time.